Good morning. Welcome to On Blast with MG. MG here. Today we're going to talk a little bit about our uh, Emerald Lagasse Power Fryer 360. I got this little unit about three months ago, and um, although it has worked really well, it comes with a lot of different functions, as you can tell. Right here, we can you know, we can boil, we could dehydrate, we could toast, we could broil, rotisserie, we got air fry, dehydrate, all kinds of stuff. We could bake pizza, roast things. The unit itself has had a few problems, and as this channel kind of reads on blast, I'm gonna put some things on blast. I'm gonna review products, and if they're good, then we're gonna tell you they're good. Um, if they're not so good, we're going to tell you what's not so good about them. So, this particular unit, the problem I've had with it is the fact that it, it leaks droppings. So, when you're making things like bacon or, um, you know, chicken, rotisserie, anything that has grease or, or has any residue that, that leaks out of the particular thing you're cooking, my unit is leaking. And as it leaks, it creates um, the it, it comes into contact, I assume, with a hot surface, and then it creates massive amounts of smoke at times. And you could see right here is mostly where the smoke comes out, and you could see that little uh, brownish uh, area that's caused by the smoke coming out of it. So, but. Here's one area, here's the areas that I noticed that it is leaking out of, and you can see a good example here. This is the front left leg. If we zoom in on it, you can see that it is leaking something that looks like grease, and it is grease. Uh, if you look underneath it a little bit further, also the back left leg is also dropping down grease some area in the middle of the back left side as well and if we look underneath it there is also an area way back there I don't think you could see it very well let me see if I could lift it for you right over there there's another area in the back if you focus that is leaking on the right side so it's not that it's tilted it is actually leaking and in the process you know, I'm assuming some of that grease or whatever it is gets into the unit, some of the hot surfaces, and it creates some smoke. And I'll get a little bit of smoke, that's fine, you know, we're cooking things, but it is actually burning and it is setting off my uh, smoke detectors in the house half the time. So half the time I have to cook with a uh, window open or even take off the smoke detectors, which is the, the thing that I've been doing lately. So. Uh, I did send out an email to uh, to the uh, person I bought it from, which, uh, well, it's an authorized dealer for Emerald Lagasse. I bought it off of Amazon. So I sent out an email to them today um, asking them if this is an actual problem or my unit is defective. If it is defective, obviously I would like a new one. So we'll see. We'll let you, we'll let you guys know what happens uh, with that. But... As far as the unit itself goes, it has definitely been a great piece of, a great kitchen tool. You know, I could definitely do all those things that it says it does, it does them pretty well. And it has been a really good tool. It's unfortunate that it does uh, leak, apparently. I don't know if it's, uh, you know, this drip tray right here, you can see. It does have a lip at the front, but it doesn't have really anything at the bottom. You know, it is... It's, you know, it's sunken in, so the grease should stay there, but, you know, the sides of it don't have a lip, and I could see how the, the grease could, you know, as it's cooking, it could just, you know, jump, you know, it's going to spray, it's not going to just gonna drop straight down, and it might go to the left and right side of it, so, I don't know, that could be a design problem, design flaw, um, we'll see. We'll see what they say. I'll show you guys the email really quick. I'll put it at the beginning of this video. You can see what I sent out to Amazon. It was very nice about it. Um, I, I just told them exactly what happened. I took some pictures and they, you know, if they asked for them, I could provide them. I love the unit. I don't want to return it, 
but um, if this is going to cause me to have smoke billow out of it every time I cook something that's a little bit greasy or has some drippings, then I don't know if it's really that worth it. So let me know what you think in the comments below and uh, if you've had the same experience. Otherwise, I'll keep you posted as to what Amazon or the um, approved retailer through Amazon of the Emerald Lagasse uh, Air Fryer 360 says. Thank you for watching and please subscribe.